I haven't achieved anything. There's a long way to go. I feel my career has just started. Let me tell you that," said Shri Devi, laughing in November 2017, who spent 50 years of her 54 years of life living the cinematic dream. I feel like a newcomer. I feel that my career is going to start now. It's not finished. It's going to start now," she asserted, dismissing any desires to treat her fans to an autobiography, replete with stories from her glorious life, starting as a child actor at four to superstardom in India. Born in Sivakasi in Tamil Nadu on August 13, 1963, Sri Devi began her career at the age of four in the devotional film Thunaivan. That marked the beginning of a journey in filmdom that saw her work across Tamil, Telugu, Kannada, Malayalam, and Hindi productions, leading her to become one of the most formidable actresses of the 1980s and 1990s in Bollywood. In fact, the only female superstar the industry has seen. Kamal Hassan, who worked with Sri Devi in 27 films, said, "She was actor in almost all languages uh, in India and with, in about 27 films with me. Uh, I, the moments we've had together were all in, in film shootings. We we were working so continuously that our personal life was on the periphery. So uh, the kind of dedication." she had truly matched mine and so it's no wonder that we were fond of each other remembering their sadma days he said sadma song rings in my ears now i think that's a great lullaby for this talented beautiful sri devi That's our lullaby for her. She had a happy life. My deepest condolences to the family. Sri Devi grew up to be known for not just her ability for slip into myriad roles, whether the double role in Chalbaz as a woman with retrograde amnesia in Sadma, a shape-shifting woman in Nagin, a goofy crime journalist in Mr. India, the warm mother act in English English. or the fierce and revengeful mom in mom but also for her expressive eyes sheer comic timing and her fluid dancing skills all of which made her a director's delight hawa hawai main teri dushman morni na jaane kahan se aayi hai mere haathon mein are some of the iconic and classic dance numbers which gave cinema fans a chance to see the dancing talent of shri devi In 2013, the government featured her with the Padma Shri, the country's fourth highest civilian award. Her work was widely lauded with a slew of other richly deserved honors. Shri Devi, who over the years became quite a fashion icon, sometimes giving tough competition to daughters, commanded popularity like few others. In an industry where women beyond a certain age struggled to find roles, a 50-plus Sri Devi proved she still had it in her when she carried two films: her comeback vehicle, English Finglish, and last year's Mom on her shoulders. The 2012 film English Finglish marked her return to films 15 years after the 1997 movie Judai. And what a comeback it was playing the role of a traditional Indian housewife's struggle with the English language in the US she was simply outstanding a mother of two daughters Janvi and Kushi whom she had with husband Boni Kapoor Shri Devi was as doting as a mom could get she was excited for Janvi's upcoming debut Dharak just months away from its release and aside the unpredictability of life who knew shri devi wouldn't be there to see her daughter take baby steps into a world where she was the uncrowned queen